On July 19, 2020, Bernice Simmons lost her life in what doctors determined was pulmonary embolism. Bernice was only 16 years of age. Bernice is identified as part of the LGBTQ community, and her family believes that constant bullying from those in the Brentwood, Long Island School District may have led to undue stress that may have caused her to lose her life. The family is searching for answers. Cherie Sibley Simmons says that her daughter, Bernice, was not afraid to speak up about what was right. She wasn't afraid to help people or children that was in need. No sisters! No peace! Here, a small crowd has joined in front of the Brentwood School's administrative building demanding justice. We're not out here for the wrong. We're out here because we want justice. And an investigation on what role the district played in her death. We will continuously be here. So, and that's why I'm here today, to be her voice, to speak up for what she endured as an attendance of Brentwood School District. The family, along with the organization, the African American Cultural Festival, are calling on an independent investigator after her parents say that there was obvious signs of bullying. They say that their daughter complained to the superintendent's office in regards to the incidents and claimed that nothing was done and says Bernice Simmons began to avoid going to school. It definitely needs to be an independent person to do investigation for DASA um, so the kids can actually get proper investigation. We wouldn't want the administration to do an inf investigation on their staff when we already know it's going to come back guilty. You have a student complaining about a teacher and then you have an administrator who's a teacher who's supposed to be investigating that teacher. Things tend to get shuffled and nothing tends to happen, and then children are targeted. They've been known to be suspended and then pushed to the side, and that is what my concern is. Bernice Simmons, her mom says, suffered heavily from depression and anxiety due to claims of bullying from teachers and strongly believes that it played a role in her death. She hopes that her daughter's passing galvanizes the district to make the necessary changes. I want justice. I definitely want um, independent DASA. Um, the discipline updated for the teachers. Um, we should have the right to know how many times they've been uh, either accused or found guilty of bullying teachers. We did reach out to the Brentwood School Superintendent who refused to comment. Students have came out in droves in support of Bernice, some sharing their own stories and relaying that depression and anxiety does exist in their school setting.